the uh, pink pig is on a bit of a flyer there, moving nicely down towards the water. I think, I think it's a wolf that's chasing him, so that oh, might yes. be. I can see down in the pit lane a vast crowd of strangely dressed people. Right, ladies and gentlemen, the Biathlon and Foolishness is a reverse fundraising concept. It's an absolutely awful idea. So what we do is we make, we give all of the teams an entry. It's the team is then expected to put somebody in to represent them. If they don't want to do that, they've got the option to donate or to do something else for the charity. Or if they do want to do it, then they can fundraise. First time we did this, about, about 18 people did it. Now look at it, you absolute idiots. Hey. Here we go, the Biathlon of Foolishness 2023 has took off. There's a, there's a grey wolf there uh, going very well. Seems to be enjoying himself, he's laughing away. Do you know who that is? I'm, af I'm afraid I don't, but it's not <laughs> often you see a grey wolf being chased by Elvis. The aim is not to win, necessarily, but uh, I think just to endure, <laughs> to get it over with. And uh, Oh, the pandas are being flagged off. <laughs> they, 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 they've, they've gone for their bamboos, I think. Um, That's genius. Yes, no, the pandas have had enough, I think. Up the hill they go to the banking, through the banking and back down again. Uh, majority of the field are uh, running. Um, ah, they go to pandas with a sneaky little cut through the thing. We'll have to go to the clock of the course for that. That's a strong outfit with the uh, pink helmet and the uh, Hawaiian shorts combo. The uh, pink pig is on a bit of a flyer there, moving nicely down towards the water. I think, that, I think it's a wolf that's chasing him, so that oh, might yes. be a, he knows what danger he's in. Absolutely. The, uh, one of the three little pigs. Oh, here we go. It's, it's very slippery going down the cliff there, but down into the water they go. We've got the first of the traffic cones coming through. I think that's sort of evil Robin by the looks of it. <laughs> yeah, how, how was that? Uh, 62 year old, a cheat, and turned right out of the pit lane. Uh, see, <laughs> we've, got, uh, we've got Frozen, we've got Cinderella down here, we've got it's a rather extreme looking costume. Just getting a little bit of. Uh, Assistance down there, but there's one traffic cone's gone in now. The rest are all starting to pile down there with them. Ponte, Ponte and rise at the end where the tyre is, and then all the way back across again. The, tra the traffic cones have finally decided that they've had enough in the water and they're starting to come back up the hill now. I was kind of one to ridiculous. How cold is he now? No, you definitely hit ridiculous there. Yeah, <laughs> just touch it and really good. No, so it was going coming as well. So yeah, they're on their way. We look but great. Are you waiting for the whole collect? You're going to go in as one. As one Noah's Ark. So we've got. We've got, we've, got, we've got a parrot, a tiger, we've got Noah's leading as well, so we can get a catch on that. We're, get, we're getting a sermon on the mount right now. <laughs> so the animals are off. It's cold. We're very cold. You had some assistance getting in, didn't you? I had some assistance getting in, getting around, getting out. I've done it though. Here comes the, here come, here comes the shark as well. I think he needs a bigger boat. How was, how was that in there? Warm, very, very warm. It's not what everyone else is saying. <laughs> You'd have to try it yourself to find out. I think that's be next year, I think. How, did, how does Zebra find that? It's a uh, natural habitat, that. <laughs> natural habitat. Welcome back to the home straight. I'm going to grab Matt Dennis here as well. Matt, how cold was that? Yeah, very. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You, you, you look, I mean, that, that boob tube is something from the uh, 1980s ages. Well, I've had a job. <laughs> He's got to go. Just want to stop this man here. Um, any quash on the rumours that now you guys have come to Anglesey, the M25 roadworks are in bits? Yeah, it's in, it's in chaos down there now. What have you come as? Just a bum. Jaws and his girlfriend are uh, just coming for a, a day out of the beach, I assume, Dustin? I'd just like to say... Oh, oh, princess. Oh, oh, princess. Oh, you saved me. I love you, Sharky. I love you too. I love you, Sharky. Will you? Yes. Oh, we got a race on here between the cows. The cows are going for the finish. Who's going to take it over the line? <laughs> Just about. We, we got to get you on the telly, come on. Clearly, uh, there's an issue that's gone on with uh, yours there, or you've just yeah. not gone for the inflation. Yeah, uh, I don't think piggies can swim, after all. <laughs> Bacon isn't waterproof. No, or pork. <laughs> no, I don't think any of them are, to be honest. How was that for you? It was really nice, actually. Yeah? No. Absolutely bonkers, isn't it? Uh, who would do that? Who would do that? I think that's about time down here on the starting grid. We're going to hand back up to Paul Trustwell in the commentary box to take you through the rest of the craziness. And then we've got a motor race to prepare for. The aim of this biathlon of foolishness is raising money. 
Uh, I, I don't want to put too much of a thing on it, but Mission Motorsport saved my life. Um, when I was in a very dark place, uh, my wife, the Duchess, uh, pointed me towards Mission Motorsport. They took me in, took me in their arms, and then got me on the, the road to recovery as they have done for many people. 